And apologies for the um, kind of halting nature of this video. It's just beset with problems. Uh, well, not so much a problem, just a, a, log a logistic, uh, logistical nightmare of sorts. So first time around, the um, could maybe do with another uh, another surgeon. Never mind, I'll just have to wait. Yeah, first the um, uh, fraps was playing up, so I had to figure out what's wrong with that. And then the um, the SD card and my uh, camcorder, which I'm recording my voice on with this. It seems like a bit of underutilisation, being that I'm only sort of capturing my voice on a device that can uh, do very nice pseudo high definition uh, images. Well, never mind. Yep, I'm ready to handle that. Uh, but it's only got an SD card in, yeah, that has 1.89 gigabytes. I'm surprised I'm able to get about 20 minutes worth of video in it. Hmm. I'm going to have to invest in a scanner, aren't I? I mean, what is wrong? What's wrong with. Nobody's using the X-Ray. It's all just wasted on you people. At least fed up and leaving. Never mind. Uh, what about if I replace the X-ray? Didn't get much for it. With scan. Crap, that's expensive. Let's let's let the research boffins um, do, do their magic. Probably that expensive. Oh, that's going to cost me. One of the doctors has become a protus uh, surgeon. I was worrying about the heat, wasn't I? Oh well. I've evidently stopped worrying about the heat. It's uh, summer's around the corner anyway. Hmm. Uh, put in five more radiators. There we go. How does that look? It looks too warm now. Ah, oh, it's broken. So it's little bugs like that that, that uh, just make this game not quite the uh, not quite the original. Not quite what the original was. It improves somewhat on the original. In some respects, and others have just not quite fixed the bugs yet. Give me a raise of 60. Now, you say, why don't I just let that happen every time? Well, it's a lot more economical if you give them pay rises of your own, off your own back rather than them demand, demanding it, because they demand a lot more. Damn it, that's still 12,000. Okay, where's that fella that... Oh, they're all going for, a, going for a break. Like, en masse. We've got a bit of a backlog to clear out, but we can manage that. Oh, just as he was starting to feel ill as well. Uh, 
send him home until um, the scanner becomes cheap. I've actually got plenty of money now, I'm just I'm just being tight. Six people with uh, Zinzin Thatcher's chemical plant. Six people with bloaty head. Thank you. Uh, somebody's becoming desperately ill from TV personalities. You'll have to explain to me how, how you can die from that, but uh, it's happening. Right, you need to get back to teaching. How much is a scanner now? Uh, see, now I want to get another researcher in there, since you're not doing much. I know there's a queue forming, but... Yeah. That's another thing, psychiatrists tend to get stuck in the psychiatry. Like, a bit too much. Give another handyman on the job. There we go. Not him. But what's his description? Drives rally cars, twisted and resentful, burning up with hate. <laughs> well, he sounds like a nice chap to have a hospital. Arrogant and cocky. Enjoys fart surfing. Hmm. Not bothered about the job. Bone idle. Lazy and badly motivated. Listens to the radio. Well. Wow. Goes motorcycle racing. Slow and fussy. Careless and accident prone. Enjoys fart surfing. What is it with these people? Sly, cunning and subversive. Go scuba diving. Are the two related? I think maybe. Um. Okay, fine. I'll invest in a scanner then. I mean, the layout of this hospital is all wrong, but I don't, I don't quite have the heart to like redesign it all like I did with the last hospital. Oh, look at that queue for me. And no doctors to deal with it. Oh, now you're unhappy. I want to raise to 59. Now, that's a huge amount. Whereas he'll accept 9. <sighs> well, see, he's still not really happy because he's underpaid. So that's just going to go down and down. I think I've got an emergency, but I kind of ignored it because I'm watching my staff. So in, in essence, they're to blame. I mean, they're pretty close to becoming consultants now. He's very close. The one that hasn't demanded the money yet, or something like that. Is it him? Oh no. It's the one that demanded money first. He's very close. Ooh, a VIP wants to come. Lawrence Nightingale uh, has expressed the wish to visit your hospital. Hey, well done. Have a, have a pay rise. Pay rises for everyone. People are too hot. It's good, it's July. Whoa. Let's turn that off. What was I talking about? Ooh. Is everything okay? What about the clinics? They're, they look fine. What about the operating table? It's no good, I can't get to the operating table. I really, I've tried as hard as I can to get to the other side of the hospital, it's just not happening. I'm just going to have to waste it out and hope for the best. Whew. I think that added five damage. So let's get a new inflator in. That's substantially better than the last one. And the caster remover has been improved. That's now strength 15. Slicer. That's up to a 14. There's a massive queue for the scanner, but you know, I'm not fussed. Oh, someone's been promoted to a consultant. Who is it? Have a promotion. In fact, promotions for all. Yeah. Have a pay rise. Pay rises for all.
Well, you may as well go to the staff room at the same time. If you can synchronise when your teacher and your students go to the, go to the staff room, it's more efficient, or so I'm told. You're kind of minimising the amount of time lost. I've got plenty of money, actually. Okay, what do I need to finish this level? A lot more cures, a lot more money, and more hospital value. Hospital value is going to be easy. I might buy that plot of land there and just put a scanner and... Uh, what's it called? Oh! Congratulations. I suppose you'll be wanting a pay rise. You will. And that means you can go back to work now. So now I've got an overabundance of staff. And they're all fairly uh, fairly cheap. Now you compare these surgeons here with the one I had originally. 225. Now he's fairly happy to work as a consultant for 155 a month. 196, 206. So what you can do is, you get these expensive ones at the start of the game, then you trade up cheaper ones and you sack the originals. Give that scan. So let's put the X-ray there. So this is how you sort of improve the hospital value, just putting in a load of things that people don't really need. I mean the hospital's functioning quite well with that an X-ray, but it's another, it's another 8,000, isn't it? So big, it's got two bins. Hmm. Now, I want to use that scanner, but I, uh, I don't. It's in too popular use. Any other diagnosis you can do? I wouldn't mind another pharmacy, so I'm going to move... Yeah, I'm going to move the card here, so you get out. Stick that there. Yeah. No, I said this about this in the last video. I'm not singing along to the music. It makes it difficult to sync up the the, t the two wavelengths, and also it's not very pleasant to listen to. I might put a second. Uh, pharmacy. There. Because you always need two pharmacies, because sometimes you get emergencies with huge numbers of people coming in that require fairly basic uh, treatment, but such a such a, metal, a lot of them. Um, let's hire let's hire another nurse and another, another handyman. Careful and dependable in an emergency. Listens to the radio. Well, that's smashing. Let's hope this queue goes down at some point. Excellent. I'm just not sure what I'm going to put in that space now. This is one I was singing to a couple of videos ago. I remember now. It's most embarrassing to listen to. We're all getting old quickly. We've not been in the hospital that long, I shouldn't think. You've only been to the GP's office. I'm going to put another GP's office in. The theory is that you'll go in there, you'll be dealt with either of those two GP's offices, they'll send you to a diagnosis of some kind, and then while you're in the diagnosis building, you go to a GP's office here uh, for the final prescription of cure, and then you go up here for the cure. That's it in theory, anyway. Right, no, the filing cabinet's in the wrong place.
Too far away from the doctor. Now do we need any more clinics? Inflation slack tongue fracture. You need a pay rise. Five people with slack tongue. In they come. And to think that's made my hospital valuable, isn't it? Just over the limit. Smash it. Researched all the drugs we can do. So I guess if we put improvements to 100%. Now where are you going? Oh crack, you're not going to make it in time. I die at home. Could do the second psychiatric. It's popular enough. I guess I could put it to a side. I put it aside for emergencies. Although we'll need a second psychiatrist, which could be problematic. <laughs> Enough with the bloody plants. Mm. Now that's not very efficiently done. You want the couch as close to the door as possible and the screen about there. <coughs> Here's the only side. You need a pay rise. And actually, that's why it's so grumpy and tired. Is anyone else sort of overworking themselves? I noticed he was grouchy, so it's so grouchy, so I was having to give him like a lot of money. In fact, that's too much money. Go. Over. No wonder there's a cube building, but it's just broken. Did they cure him? Well, I suppose it did. Right, who's unhappy? Have a pay rise. Have a pay rise till I sack you. Oh, it's December. Maybe you ought to turn the heating back on. If I leave it there, nobody can really complain either way. I want you to rest up, and I'm going to hire two juniors. Actually, three psychiatr uh, three cut psychiatrists might be might be overkill. We go, we'll have him, and a foolish risk taker who take a foolish risk taker who couldn't care less. Drive rally cars, you sound perfect. So as far as I know, that doesn't actually affect the performance. It's just a, it's just a bit of humour. Large queue for that pharmacy. Slight queue for that one. You've set the maximum queue. To six. Once I get to six, they'll send it to that one there. And that's how you run a, a, a hospital. Well, well, the one. Smallish war for achieving pretty impressive reputation. Um, overall value of your hospital. Some more reputation. Um, cure more patients than any other hospital. I guess a uh, reward for selling a lot of fizzy drinks, which is um, odd for a hospital. Never mind. Uh, it's a good clean trophy for best reputation and the VIP to the TRIP awards. Oh, so I've got plenty of money now. Lawrence, Lawrence Nightingale, um, like my hospital. Almost but not quite Florence Nightingale. Never mind. You're just never happy, are you? Or is it you that's not happy? I have a pay rise. I'm sorry if the speed's a bit jumpy, this is just how I play the game, I'm afraid. Maybe if I can go between 3 and 5, 
that might be less um, rather than one and five. It might be it might be easier on the eye. And what am I actually doing now? I'm waiting. How far away? Well, you're almost a psychiatrist. Oh, you both got it at the same time. That's nice. I'll have to take a ride. I'll keep an eye on them. If I do it properly, I can give them pay rises just enough so I can get them on the cheap. Oh, now he's a doctor. And he's a doctor. And there's an emergency. One person with kidney beans. Uh, have a pay rise. Oh, it's just noise. <laughs> How is she able to do that? Like, say several things at the same time. Lovely. Uh, bonus, scan has been improved. Like I give it up. Now those are all plenty strong enough, even the scanner. No, they're not happy. Fine, I'll pay you 99 a month. And compare that to what everyone else is getting. I'll put a couple of seats there in case people have to queue for the reception. It doesn't happen often, only if the hospital is terribly run. So I'll put, I'll put it there just in case. I'm still not happy. Fine. This is getting unhappy uh, slightly less often. Actually, it's sped up a bit. I think maybe because they're too warm. No, they're just being uh, just being greedy. And everyone's in the staff room. And they've been back to the classroom. This is fun to watch. Hmm. Actually, there might be something in those uh, descriptions after all. Because he wants, he wants more money, but he's okay. And there's no real difference in skill level. I think he might be the one that couldn't care, couldn't care less about the job. Yeah. Uh, hates tourists in museums. Heckles poor comedians. Drinks wine. Twisted and resentful. So I imagine he wants paying a lot. I don't know. There must be a there must be a formula of sorts here. Distills whiskey. Okay. Yeah, he does need paying more. Let's look after that in the future. And he's hot as well, so... As in warm. Um, okay, pay rise again, and I suppose you want another one now that you're consultants. Oh, that killed somebody. So original com... So original Crumbly has expressed a wish to visit your hospital. Okay. Oh, no, everyone's unhappy. But he's getting happier. Oh, blimey. Uh, there's an instance of Big Dave's funeral parlour. We've not heard from them in a while. Five people with TV personalities. What the hell happened? <laughs> Oof. Right, everywhere's still working. Oh, that. Right, one more handyman on the job. I'm 
didn't know that. Is he able to do that in record time? And he's unhappy. Well, he's not the greedy one either. Fine. He's still a lot cheaper than everyone else. I'm kind of annoyed. Just look at that price difference there. And now we've got to the point where we just have to sit back and wait for everyone to be cured. Actually, no, we've done it all. Hurrah! People are kind of thirsty there. And here we go. Dear Peck, marvellous, you have handled the running of this hospital superbly. All those big wigs at the Ministry of Health would like you to know that if you'd be interested in taking on a larger project. Let's try that again. <laughs> Dear Peck, marvellous, you have handled the running of this hospital superbly. Us big wigs at the Ministry of Health would like to know if you'd be interested in taking on a larger project. As a job we think you'd be perfect for. The salary would be $20,162. Give us some thoughts. Are you interested in a job at Festering on the Walled Hospital? <laughs> what a place name. Uh, that must adversely affect uh, property prices. Uh, never mind, I'm going to take the job. Despite the fact, as I say every time, it's a very reasonable salary for... Um, it's a very unreasonably low salary for a hospital administrator, but never mind. I will see you at Festering on the Wall. Uh, I'll see you all next time.